Hi to Chaco. Same map, but this time... Oh, same positions even. Close position. But this time the human, instead of uh, going for an expansion, he's playing aggressive. And what did Lolite get? Anyone uh, knows what is different? What is different with the standard game and Lolite's game here? That's a question for you Twitch chat. Maybe you know the answer. We have two Ancient of Wars, but that's not what I'm talking about. I stand ready. It doesn't have Hunter's Hall, it just goes uh, Archers. But last, uh, last game we also saw Double Ancient of War. I guess you have to always go Double Ancient of War when you're close position. That's why life also went Double Ancient of War last game. And then he uh, realized that the human player, uh, Sok, didn't play aggressive. So he played uh, aggressive himself instead since he had double angels of war. He was forced into double angels of war because of this close position. What's different here is that we have a priestess of the moon here for the light. And none of you guys realized it. I was testing you guys. But you guys were just like, yeah, there's nothing special here. We have a priestess of the moon first here for the light. He loses the moon well to the militia and the footman. No Warden, no Demon Hunter, just a Priestess. Is that the most defensive, uh, the best defensive hero, maybe, in close position? Maybe that's the case. Maybe she is the best at holding off these uh, militia, tower, uh, militia, footman, whatever, towers, base, uh, build orders. Uh, what do we see here for human? Is he going for an expansion? What is this, a Hunter's Hall over here? <laughs> It was so obvious. I thought it was something else. That's exactly what I was thinking. Well, we have uh, zero XP here for the arc base. We have uh, 84 here for the the priestess. Double angel of war should be able to uh, defend here. Maybe we'll see. You never know. Close position against human. <laughs> <laughs> no, look at so many militia and footmen just killing everything. The priestess here in the back just fending, but uh, sure, sure. Two, two archers still alive, but the footmen are killing them. This moon is going down. Oh, the archer is taking a lot of damage. He does have boots of speed though. The priestess, okay, apparently the priestess does win a one on one fight against the archmage when there's no water elementals, there's no footmen, there's no militia helping him. Peasants just going back home, picking up some more uh, weapons, and then probably coming back to the Knight of Base. We do, we do have finally two Huntresses. Oh, don't let the Archmage get to the to the Arches. Okay, he did use his dust too early, and we he almost dies there. Twelve hit points. Archmage taking some damage. This Water Elemental taking damage from the Ancient of War. Maybe the counter to this is not double Ancient of War, but triple Ancient of War. Goddess, light my path. Goddess, light my path. Actually, uh, it does seem like uh, the light has stabilized. <laughs> the Archway is still at uh, only 40 X, uh, XP. There's one archer. There's that one archer that he got. And the uh, Archway is going to die. Pretty good here by the light. How do you win close position against Nida, uh, against human? You get a priestess. These archers hiding. Where are we watching again? Romantic, romantic, GG.